my name is Tony Ogendi uh, from Homer Bay Town. Uh, we have a, a challenge in Homer Bay County. We have so many deaf in the village. Uh, they don't access information because of communication. Uh, we only have few who, who, who are uh, aware about HIV. We are, we are asking uh, the government to help us so that we can uh, access information. Because the, the government, they must know. Maybe someone who is deaf, who is HIV positive, how can they access information in the hospital? Like Homabi County Referral Hospital. Uh, 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 the, the, number two, when maybe a deaf woman is pregnant, uh, now both couples, if they are both positive, when now the baby is born, but now the, the, the parents will not even know how to take care of their child, which medicine maybe to use. So now they, they, they need the doctor to give the correct medicine. Uh, no, if they, the interpreters are there in the hospital, it will be easier for them to access information, to understand. Now, like the county hospital, referral hospital, they need now to, to train deaf who are HIV positive, to train them, to train them on how maybe they can uh, take access drugs, drugs, how can they protect themselves. Uh, now, maybe if they are given AR, ARVs, will protect, but you know, we know many people who are hearing, they know how to take care of themselves. But with deaf people, they, most of them, they don't know how to take care of themselves or maybe to protect themselves. And you, you will find some of them got maybe HIV, HIV, HIV when they are young, growing up, not knowing the right medicine to take. So I think that is why it is very important to, to do awareness, training, the benefits maybe those who are HIV positive can get.